Hey gents, today we're talking about three shirts, one, two, three, six months of waiting, and one company that is Suit Supply. So today let's dive into the shirts of Suit Supply. I'd say Suit Supply is one of the number one most requested companies that I get. They don't have a lot of like reviews or marketing out there, which is really interesting because they are this like secret giant in the industry. I think Suit Supply is doing things really right right now. I think they're replacing J. Crew for a lot of guys, which is like they have this great imagery, they have a very nice aesthetic, and the clothes are pretty affordable. It's like just attainable for a lot of things, and I agree with that. More importantly, they have great product. So today we're gonna take a look at is this is one of the just off the rack. This is the red line shirt where I just ordered my size. This is one of their made to measure in store custom shirts which I did back in August and I have a little bit of video from that. And then this is a shirt from their made to order program which I ordered this as soon as it was launched. They have a four to six week delivery time and it allows you to customize a couple of things on the shirt but then more importantly get the exact size for neck and arm length. And we'll talk about the differences between the experience of all three. First we'll start off with just their off the rack offering. This is the shirt that you go online, you can just order it and it's shipped in two days. Suit Supply ships extremely quickly, whether it's a shirt or the suit that I ordered a while ago. So this is just from the blue line. This is a shirt I ordered the 15 and a half and it fits me nearly perfectly. So what I really like about Suit Supply is you can get great shirts at the $79 price point. These are really tough to beat and it comes with you know some, some nice fabric. You can go into the red line or something a little bit more premium and they step up. You know, this starts at $79, then I think it goes to like $119 and $149 depending on the fabric that you want. But I think for $79, this is really tough to beat. And if you're still buying shirts in like a small, medium, large size, one of the things that you know I try to talk about on this channel is I'm 6'4 and 170. I have a very long wingspan and I have a very slim torso. And so if I try to buy anything small, medium, large, it doesn't fit. Buy dress shirts with your neck size and your arm length because that's what will get you a good fit. Suit Supply can get you started here. And if you want to step up a little bit, you can go to the made to order route. So this is the made to order shirt and it is starting at 119. And what you can do here is customize the collar. You can customize the cuff style. You can add a initial or monogram. And for 119, you're also getting a more premium fabric than the blue line at $79. You can also customize if you want a twill or an Oxford cotton. You can also select the color that you want. And so you can't do a ton of customizations on here, but you can do enough. And now this is delivered in four to six weeks. This one for me took about five. And the only problem with this one is I selected my neck size, I selected my arm size, but I selected a long model and it extended the sleeve. So you can see in the try on video, the sleeves are too long, but another big bonus about Suit Supply and you can see in the unboxing is that they do have the return label right in the box. So you can drop this in within 30 days, ship it right back, either do an exchange or return and Suit Supply, their customer service has been incredible. And I'll talk about that as I talk about the uh, saga of getting this made to measure shirt over the past six and eight, and eight months. But before we move on with the made to order option with Suit Supply, you're going to be able to customize things in a large way as you can with other companies. Now you can't get exact, you know, you can't put in your measurements, but keep in mind with made to measure companies, it's not bespoke. They're not making things to within a centimeter or two of your exact measurements. With made to measure, they're getting really close with off the rack models, making a few adjustments and optimizations optimizations, for the most part, you're going to be able to get an excellent fitting shirt as almost as good as made to measure out of the made to order option, especially if you're a fairly regular size. And with Suit Supply, you can't do custom made to measure unless you're at a store. So if you don't live near one, it's really tough because not only do you have to go in for the measurements, but then you have to go back if you want to have the follow-ups and the adjustments after you receive the shirt. I'm still trying to figure out where Suit Supply's made to order fits in the grand scheme of all the made to measure companies, but uh, I'm working on that roundup video. Uh, and for now, let's talk about the made to measure option of Suit Supply. You know, made to measure in general is for nitpicky people, and I'm a nitpicky person. Suit Supply's made to measure offerings are one of the few in this entire space where you can't just go online, throw in some measurements, and get a shirt. You have to go into a store, work with somebody there, and then it's really best if you live near a store because you have to go in for the measurements, and then they ship the shirt to the store, go back, you get those alterations and then that's all included and then they give you the shirt now for me I go to New York a lot I went in I got measured and they shipped the shirt
the shirt to my house because I have confidence that it's going to fit really well and I'm going to be back there pretty soon. But that is a key difference from somebody like Indochino, Oliver Wicks, or any or, or Lignetti or any of these other companies where you can just go online and put in your measurements. Now, the personal touch is what sets Suit Supply apart. I spent about an hour in the store in Soho. I worked with a lovely woman named Gina. She talked to me about what I wanted out of the shirt. She talked to me about my collar options, my cuff options, if I wanted the shirt longer because I tuck it in, if I wanted to, to fit a certain way. And so that really personal touch is what you're paying for because you're also going to be starting your prices a little bit higher than if you were just to go either with a made to order option of Suit Supply or any of the other made to measure options, whether you're going with Deo Veritas that start at like $80 or Oliver Wick stuff is like $129. What's nice here is you're really paying for the fabrics. They don't have all these upcharges. You know, one of the companies that I've ordered from, they upcharge you for uh, picking a certain fabric, then they upcharge you for monogram, they upcharge you for all this stuff. And with Suit Supply, it's all built in. You're just choosing the quality of fabric that you want. And because these prices are higher, they're only giving you some of the best that they offer. They offer fabrics in this program that you can't even order from the regular online offering. You know, the red line starts at 149, and that fabric is your baseline of your made to measure, and then you can go up from there. Now, this process is supposed to take four to six weeks. My fabric was delayed that I had chosen and they had some trouble contacting me, which is why it took six months. You know, I did have the option to switch fabrics and get something a little bit sooner, but I wasn't too worried about it. And now what this really does, now that I have this form with Suit Supply, I can go, I can call Suit Supply and I can order additional shirts using my already set measurements and then basically just build out my wardrobe because now I have the perfect fit coming from them, which is what you really want with these made to measure companies. You wanna get one that gets it right, then you can order subsequent things from them without any additional work. And back to that personal, in-store touch. Some of the things I did with this shirt I wouldn't have done necessarily on my own. You know, I talked to Gina about the monogram. So instead of putting it on the sleeve, she was letting me know that the traditional way of doing the monogram is to have it on your you know, your chest, stomach, like I have on here. And because that goes back to uh, the old Italian countryside where you would have the initials on the shirt for laundry, but putting it on the sleeve is something that's not really, you know, it's not classic. I knew I wanted to have a shirt for cuff links, but I almost chose a single ply instead of a rolled version, which is a little bit more traditional. So instead of like the website, a lot of companies, they'll say like these options mean this. It was really nice to have that conversation about the shirt overall and what I'm trying to accomplish by wearing the shirt. I also got two different sizes on my shirt cuffs. So this is my nice slim version here but then my left one has some variants for my watch I have two dive watches that I typically wear and I know that this shirt is going to be a certain purpose of shirt and I will basically always have my watch and so that's a really nice little feature it's something else I did with uh, proper cloth so the verdict suit supply if you need a shirt right now and you need cheap the off the rack versions are going to be a great price and you're going to be able to get pretty close to your size the made to order you'll be able to get a lot closer on your exact size neck wise and sleeve length but then also you can make some of the customizations that you want and it's a good price and if you live near a store the made to measure option is great now that will come down to you if you want to spend 160 dollars on dress shirts continually or you know i think you just need to have a few of these in your collection you have your really nice fitting your really nice looking stuff and that's why i went with more of like you know i didn't go with a casual shirt want that personal touch just go into the store spend an hour with your stylist i think that's a great experience but if you want to just get some quick shirts and you want to make a little bit of customizations the made to order option is great so you have a gents if you have any experience with suit supply let us know down in the comments below love to hear from you guys down there if you have any questions or you want to see behind the scenes stuff you can also reach out at the underscore cavalier on twitter and instagram love to hear from you guys over there and i got some more great stuff like this coming up for you and as always suggestions are welcome until next time gents this is the cavalier